So you know how there's those videos on YouTube that are like, I bought a cursed item off of the internet, and how there's like two ways that people use the word cursed. There's kind of cursed in the sense of like internet cursed, and if you're on the internet enough, you know what I'm talking about. Um, like a cursed image or whatever. Um, but then there's also cursed in the sense of like haunted, like something that has a terrible history attached to it sort of thing, um, like a haunted object. Well, I wanted to find an item that is both cursed in the internet sense as well as cursed in the traditional sense. And I think that I found it. All right, we got some uh, safety gloves here. Because I'm not touching this without some sort of protection. really tightly packed. I cut it like this, hope that I don't cut anything useful. Oh boy. Oh my god. It comes, it comes with this, I didn't, I did not expect it to come with its own proper thing. Oh my god. Here I have my own Sonichu medallion from the Christian. Oh yeah, that shit's sticky and nasty. Holy shit, I can't believe I actually got one. Man, I don't know if you can see it, but you know, you've got the, um, you can see the, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but there you go, yeah you can. The little fingerprints all over there. <laughs> These deep ass fingerprints. Oh, it's such, it's so iconic. It's so cursed. I love the fact that there's Chris's hair in it. <laughs> that's just been embedded into it. Like, oh man, it even, probably, dangerous to do that, but I just smelled it. And you can, you can just smell the horrors from where this came from. I, I feel like I'm touching a holy relic. All right, so this is me wearing my true and honest Sonichu medallion, handmade by Chris Chan. Um, truly a sight to behold. It looks, I think I look great in it, but I don't really want to wear this for too long because as I mentioned before, it is pretty nasty and sticky. It feels cursed. Yeah, I don't know if I'm proud of owning this item in that I have a very, you know, a limited piece of history or if I am ashamed of owning this item because of the implications of providing financial support to this person by buying um, merchandise on the other hand, I do own a piece of Christery, as people call it. You know, if you don't understand that, if, if the word Christery means nothing to you, you probably have a much better quality of life than I do. And I hope that you keep it that way. I don't know. It's pretty nasty overall. Not a big fan. But also, you know, I kind of like horrible things. So I'm going to go put this back in the package and then um, seal it. And then uh, buy a display case and put it in a display case. This is truly horrifying and I love it for that reason. So I think that I have successfully found something truly internet cursed in the sense that Sonic Chu is pretty cursed looking and the drawings are pretty cursed looking considering the art style never improved. Um, but also cursed in the sense that this is Chris Chan. Period. So I think that I win um, this argument I win the I bought a cursed item off of Etsy video style genre, and I'm never doing something anything like this ever again. Um, yeah, peace.